everybody wonders what goes on here at Playmaker Training during the day. Like, what time do I get here? That varies, but there's a lot of work to do sometimes around this place. The door's just locked. And as you can see, I need to shovel, so I need to unlock that door. Now, no cups. So now, I gotta get cups. One day, I'm going to have electronic locks on every door in this facility. Because I hate keys. I want these. The real business of today is all over the facility, all over the training area, we have these uh, cables that protect the, the drywall from getting hit. Well, we have a little bit of a problem. This happened a couple weeks ago and the owner and I figured out how to, you know, fix it, but it happened again. You see this cord? This is how it's supposed to be, tight. And this one is down, so time to fix it. to go and untighten the other side before I can reach this one. Hopefully that's enough to get it to the other side. So I actually fixed this yesterday, but I forgot to tighten the other side after I connected. So it's probably my fault. That was not on purpose, that was not for theatrical purposes. This did not happen yesterday. This is, this is where I failed yesterday. Now, I gotta go back to this side. And tighten that side. Damn it. Ow. That hurt. Ow. What is going on? First things first, get this edge in electrical tape so I stopped cutting myself. Okay, at least I now have <laughs> both sides connected. Oh. 
also going to tape it to this side because I know that it's going to happen again. I'm definitely taping this side so that I don't rip my hands up like I did on this side. Okay, I'm going to go tighten up the other side one more time and then we should be done. Whew. Took a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. But now, as you can see, the balls won't hit the drywall. Now, most of you are probably like, oh my god, that, that was a big ordeal just to fix one cable in, in all of the facility. And is it worth it? Hell yeah, it's worth it. I get, this place is my own. This is mine. And if I had to do all this stuff for somebody else, if I had to do this for, uh, you know, at the at another facility where I was just renting, um, you know, a few hours here and there, absolutely not. But this place is mine. And along with the owners, we have, you know, a good understanding of this is what it entails to run, a, you know, a facility and have your own facility. Back at the old place, the manager once said, do you really want to, you know, do you really want to have to deal with the schedules and do you really have to deal with the maintenance and stuff? It's like, yeah, because it's my own. He was just working for somebody else, maintaining that facility. This is mine. So absolutely. So if you're thinking about trying to do your own facility, you have little, you know, hiccups, you have little problems, but for the most part, it's all worth it. This is a dream come true, and I couldn't be happier. Now, I start in 15 minutes doing the real work, training.